The bald wakari, Cacajau calvus, is a species of monkey found in the Amazon rainforest of Brazil and Peru. It is known for its distinctive appearance, characterized by a bald head and bright red or pink face. The lack of fur on its face is believed to aid in thermoregulation and may also serve as a visual signal of health and dominance. Bald wakaris live in large social groups and primarily feed on fruits, seeds and small invertebrates. They play a crucial role in seed dispersal and contribute to the health of the rainforest ecosystem. Threats to their survival include habitat loss, deforestation and hunting for bushmeat. Conservation efforts are underway to protect their habitats and ensure their long-term survival. Sloths are slow-moving mammals native to Central and South America, known for their relaxed lifestyle and slow metabolism. They spend most of their time hanging upside down from trees in tropical rainforests, using their long claws to grip branches. Sloths primarily eat leaves, buds, and fruit, with their slow digestive system helping them extract nutrients from their low-energy diet. They have a unique adaptation where algae grow in their fur, providing camouflage in the trees. Despite their sluggish appearance, sloths are strong swimmers and can move quickly if needed. They are mostly solitary animals, except during the mating season. The proboscis monkey, Nasalis larvatus, is a unique and endangered primate species native to the island of Borneo in Southeast Asia. It is renowned for its distinctive large, fleshy nose, which is believed to amplify vocalizations and may also serve as a visual signal of dominance and health. Proboscis monkeys inhabit coastal forests, mangroves, and riverine habitats, where they primarily feed on leaves, fruits, and seeds. They are excellent swimmers and are often seen diving into rivers to evade predators or to forage for food. Threats to proboscis monkey populations include habitat loss due to deforestation, hunting, and human disturbance, leading to their classification as endangered by the IUCN. Conservation efforts are underway to protect their habitats and ensure the survival of this unique species. The saddleback caterpillar is a small but striking insect found in North America. It gets its name from the prominent saddle-shaped marking on its back. Despite its vibrant appearance, it's considered a pest due to its venomous spines, which can cause painful reactions upon contact with human skin. These spines serve as a defense mechanism against predators. The caterpillars feed on a variety of plants and can be particularly damaging to crops and ornamental plants. While they eventually transform into harmless moths, their larval stage is notorious for causing discomfort to unsuspecting individuals who come into contact with them. Mudskippers are a unique group of fish belonging to the family Oxudocidae, known for their ability to move and breathe both on land and in water. Found in coastal regions of the Indo-Pacific, they inhabit mudflats, mangroves and tidal areas. Mudskippers have adapted to terrestrial life by using their pectoral fins to walk on land, enabling them to explore their surroundings and hunt for food such as insects and small crustaceans. They possess specialised respiratory organs called branchial chambers, which allow them to extract oxygen from air as well as water. This remarkable adaptation enables mudskippers to thrive in dynamic and challenging intertidal habitats. The Cape Rain Frog, native to South Africa's Western Cape, boasts a distinctive appearance and behavior. With a rounded body, short snout, and robust limbs, it varies in color from light gray to brown. These nocturnal frogs inhabit moist environments like forests and grasslands, spending much time underground and emerging to forage during rain or night. Their diet consists mainly of small invertebrates. Known for their melodious, whistle-like call, they communicate primarily during breeding. Despite their localized habitat, they play a crucial ecological role, but face threats from habitat loss and climate change, underscoring the need for conservation measures. The okapi is a unique mammal native to the Ituri rainforest in the Democratic Republic of the Congo. Resembling a cross between a zebra and a giraffe, it has striped legs like a zebra, but a long neck and head like a giraffe. The okapi's velvety brown coat helps it blend into the forest environment. They are primarily solitary animals and are most active during the day. Okapis are herbivores, 
feeding on leaves, fruits, and other vegetation. They are currently classified as endangered due to habitat loss and hunting pressures. Conservation efforts are underway to protect their remaining populations in the wild.